I hope you're having a wonderful time of life. Thank you for clicking on this video. I am so excited to be back and I am like back back I'm ready to make videos weekly again. Life is good, but we'll get into that. If you are completely new to my channel, then welcome. My name is Maddie and I am a science fiction fantasy author and I am about to publish my debut novel. And on this channel, I just post vlogs, writing things, whatever, except I haven't posted in a while. Like I said, I am back. Really, this is like a completely new chapter of my life and now that I'm in it a little bit, I'm so excited and so happy to be closing the last chapter. I think it was just more than overdue. It was, I was just holding on to it for too long, but now we're starting things up again and yeah, life is just life is good. I'm just super excited for what this means, not only for my day, day job, um, but also for my writing career in YouTube. I feel like I just have so much more mental and physical and emotional energy to invest into my projects rather than just kind of like scraping by and just like like you got to do it because you have to get it done uh, which is really what I felt like by the end of my time at PetSmart. Uh, even when I was editing my last video which was way back in March maybe April I don't know it was a while ago though even when I was editing it I could just see like the lifelessness in my skin my eyes everything about it I could just tell that I was done I was pushing myself past what I could handle and yeah really just not having like a great time of it my creativity was shot and just every part of me was so exhausted so since then so since March it's now June like the middle of June almost end of June I quit PetSmart and I got a new job this is a recent development. I had gone down to part-time at PetSmart and was gonna try and push through and just see if like less hours could kind of be able to like regain some of the like life in myself. Um, spoiler alert, I did not. But I, my friend kind of, it really aligned well. My friend helped me get this amazing opportunity to work from home and it is like content creation, writing blogs, like just kind of being the, like a virtual assistant is what, being a virtual assistant. And I absolutely am in love with my job. Oh my God, I never thought I would say that, but it's so nice. Um, I, I put in my two weeks at PetSmart and while I was finishing that up I started so that was a little bit of a stressful time to work double jobs um, but it was really great to kind of dip my toes into what content writing on a more still creative but a little bit more technical and then also figuring out how to or learning how to you know write in other people's voices and ranging from professional to casual um, it's been really great and everything that I've learned has I think only made me as like a creative fiction writer stronger as well um, and yeah that's just been really nice to have more autonomy over my time like I still have to you know work throughout the day and get the hours in um, but I can take you know, like an hour for lunch and rest a little bit and just have a little bit more freedom. So, so that's been really great as well. And I don't know, I hope if you like have been watching my channel that I look better. I don't know, maybe let me rephrase. I hope if you have been watching my channel that like you, I don't know how I want to phrase this. I hope if you've been a long time watcher of my channel, you are just ready for content to start happening again because there it was the long long break um and yeah I just feel even like sitting in front of the camera it's so makes me happy and I think life is just kind of you know I'm kind of getting closer and closer to what I picture you know for like that ideal 
my ideal day to day life and just, yeah, we're moving up in the world. In book news, I just sent TCF off to the editor for copy edits, which is so exciting and also terrifying because now it's done. I can't develop mentally edit or do too much line editing because I want everything to like be as perfect as possible and just like lined up and all the grammar correct and word choice correct so I'm excited and terrified for that as well and I am accepting ARC readers. I've started putting out like you can sign up for ARC reading on Instagram um, but yes please please sign up to be an ARC reader if you would like the form. I'll have it linked down below. There's also a link so you can read the first chapter to see if it's like up your alley or not. Um, but yeah, I'm super excited for that. And as I vlog, I'll be probably talking about that more since that's kind of the purpose of like my Instagram right now. Yeah, it's just, yeah, so I feel like it's September's coming up and it still is so far away. I plan on sending out ARCs probably sometime in July. Well, probably it's in the mouth through July and August, depending on if I still have people signing up. I honestly really don't care how many I send out. Like my minimum number, my goal is 100. But if let's say like more than that sign up, I don't care. I will give you the book for free because this is really about establishing like a readership base truly. Like I don't expect to be making like money off of this book. Really just to A, actually publish something instead of like edit editing it or just shelving it, editing editing it for the rest of my life or shelving it. So it's like A is for me to put myself out there and B to yeah, kind of establish the readership base. Um, I don't know, I have the first proof copy from Amazon. It's so exciting. It looks better than I thought it would. Um, and it's just so surreal that it's like actually in book form, not even just printed out, but like it looks like a book and I've been reading through it. There's definitely some stuff where if I was, you know, like a lot of this has been written for a while and it, there's some things that I'm like, if I was starting over today, I would do it differently. But I think I just have to accept that and hope that that is a sign that I'm improving um, and hope that this is still like good enough. And I think that's where I'm at, you know, I can't, edit it forever, which is kind of what I want to do, but it's here. And I I didn't think it was possible to love and hate something so much, but here we are and I do. Um, so with that, and now with this like new amount of energy that I have, I am really, it's really my goal to just kind of be in a constant state of working on a project. So I, I'll like link it on one of these sides, I forget which one. But a while back I outlined a second trilogy, so I've actually started drafting a zero draft, which for me is just like, it's what I need because I cannot outline past like, say the cat plot beats. Um, so I'm writing a zero draft for the first book in that trilogy because I'm going to release them like concurrently. And it's my goal to have that zero draft done by October uh, so I can prep and outline this whole fate book two so I can use NaNoWriMo to get that zero draft done for book two. Um, I just always want to have like a project that I'm working towards so I can kind of get up to ideally getting a book out maybe every year or every nine months would be so great if I could get up to like Brandon Sanderson levels of writing, that would be even better. Um, but I think we should start a little bit smaller. But yeah, I just wanted to put an update video. I'm back, I'm doing a lot better in life, and I'm excited for, just excited to see what this like next chapter brings. So for YouTube, I'm gonna get into weekly vlogging. It's just going through like day to day, whatever I'm working on writing-wise and just kind of, yeah, going through my writing process and seeing how much more streamlined it is after the chaotic mess that is 
the writing process for this cruel fate um and i would like to eventually get up to like two additional videos a month so whether that's on writing craft or books i've been reading movies just like more maybe video essay type style i'm not entirely sure yet and i don't think that will start for at least a few months while i get into the habit of like filming and editing and all of that on top of creative projects yeah i have more here to talk about but i think this is like a really good i'm back video um i will see you guys next week if you would like to, you can sign up for an ARC copy of This Cool Fate. I'm also redoing my newsletter, so if you were subscribed to my old newsletter, please subscribe to my new one. I'll leave that link down below. I'm going to do Substack um, because I just think it's a lot easier of a platform. Um, so I'll have my newsletter sign up, ARC reader sign up, and yeah, I'm so excited to be back.